December 9th, 7.50 a.m., Tromsø, Norway. A beautiful spiral event in the sky. Perfectly symmetrical spirals, one with blue and one white, claimed by the media to be caused by a failed Russian missile. Kevin Martin claims that um, trigonometry proves that the event occurred in the White Sea. But there's a couple of data points that he's not using in his calculation. There is an ice cap facility near Tronso which conducts ionospheric heating experiments. They were conducting a tequila sunrise experiment, the experiment to observe the polar mesosphere winter echoes, PMWE, as this schedule notice shows and as this power consumption graph of the facility at exactly the same time of the spiral event. And finally, at the study of PMWE phenomena that they are using meteorological or sounding rockets, which are relatively small rockets that don't require large ground installations for their launching. Okay, so let's try to dissect this thing. This is the normal trajectory to Kamchatka here is where the ballistic missiles are usually tested. This is about 500 kilometers, uh, 500 miles from Tromsø, Tromsø to the White Sea. This is the view from a different direction. This is the 500 miles to the White Sea. That's the trajectory. This is the 100 mile mark. We move it a little bit away from the White Sea so that to compensate for the trajectory. And that's the trajectory. So the supposed spiral event happened around 97 to 106 miles away, uh, about. We can draw the line of sight. That gives us roughly the 11 degree elevation that the weatherman was talking about. But knowing that Ice Cup was uh, carrying out the Tequila Sunrise experiment, and the Tequila Sunrise is uh, messing around with a mesosphere, which is uh, a height between 30 to 50 miles above the Earth. Uh, I've uh, divided the 100 miles into three, it gives me th roughly 33 miles. And I draw a line from those 33 miles high, similar to the ground track. And that would give us an actual event that would be much lower and much closer to Tronson, and we would still have the 11 degree elevation that shows in the photos. And what do we have around Tronso in this line of sight? Ice cap. There is the antenna array that is bombarding the mesosphere. By the way, any controversy about where the event occurred could be easily uh, solved, whether it's a hundred kilo hundred miles up high in the from the White Sea or close by ice cap someplace around here. If we have any witnesses, anybody in Finnmark, they should have been able to see the event, which direction the people were facing during the event. Then we'll know more or less with a much more accuracy where the event actually occurred. Does anybody know somebody there that can report back to us? That'd be nice. Notice the perfectly symmetrical spiral of more than 20 turns. This is not smoke. Notice the contrail smoke being blown by the wind on the lower right. Yet, the supposed smoke from the spiral is unaffected. So, if the event was not caused by a Russian failed missile, it was most likely caused by an experiment carried out by ice cap. A couple of questions spring immediately to mind. Why didn't IceCap just come out and say, hey folks, relax, it's just something we're experimenting with? 
And then, why did the Russians take the undeserved humiliation of uh, claiming of missile failure? That's strange. Something fishy going on around here, don't you think? <laughs>